All right, Erica, good advice. Thank you so much. A Suncoast teenager has now become the focus of a missing persons case. Jabez Spann was last seen on Labor Day. And as ABC 7's Bo Beth Yates shows us, the community and his mother are now rallying to bring him back home. It's a situation that many say they would not wish on their worst enemy, a child winding up missing. But one mom says she's not giving up and she's asking the community for help. A 14 year old does not fall off the face of the earth without a trace for nothing. Tawana Spann's son, Jabez, has been missing since September 4th. According to those close to him, the teenager was last seen playing outside near his grandmother's home in Newtown. But when he did not come home that afternoon, his family immediately became alarmed. There's no hint of him being anywhere. There's no social media. There's no record of him with his friends. Tawana says law enforcement even attempted to trace Jabez's cell phone, but that was unsuccessful, which means the child has seemingly vanished. To be a mother and trying to call for your child in the woods or walk in the woods to try to find out if he's there, this is, okay, I understand whatever, but like if there's anybody that know anything, like don't just let him. If something had, don't just let him just be out there like that. I'm not saying that. Even if you know his whereabouts. <laughs> Jabez is described as a happy and compassionate child. He was also a star athlete who recently returned from a travel football game where he played in the Dallas Cowboys Stadium. And he even met one of his idols, Cam Newton. Tawana and her boyfriend, Joe Butler, says Jabez was on a path to college where he'd hoped to continue his football career. Because of that, the couple doubts their child ran away, and they now fear the worst. Each day that goes on, a little more hope is taken away from you. You know, the more hope, a sense of almost defeat can almost come up to you. Nothing that Irma or Harvey together put together could compare, because it's devastating, and not knowing it's even worse because every day it, the pain, the confusion just grows and grows and grows. So if anybody has information, like she said, we, we just want to know. We just want, we just want it to stop. A $5,000 reward is being offered for Jabez's safe return. Anyone with information is asked to call Crime Stoppers. Bo Beth Yates, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.